Hello, happy Veterans Day 2015. Today I'm gonna to be demonstrating my voice activated home automation system uh, via series and via Amazon Echo. Um, I'm gonna go through some commands and then I'm gonna talk a little bit about the hardware and the software I'm using. Um, excuse the mess, I just got this TV. I'm not done wiring and mounting everything yet. Um, and also the Amazon Echo really isn't out, supposed to be out here. It's, it's usually in the kitchen, but for this demo, I brought it out here. Uh, let's get started. Alexa, turn on TV. Okay. Alexa, turn on TV LED. Okay. Alexa, turn on fade TV LED. Okay. Alexa, turn on TV volume. Alexa, turn off TV volume. Okay. Alexa, turn off TV sound. Okay. Alexa, turn on living room light. Okay. Alexa, turn on dining room light 10%. Okay. Alexa, here's my arcade machine. Uh... I have two kids, it's for them, not for me. Um, it's running a Windows PC with Hyperspin. Alexa, turn off arcade machine. Okay. So notice that's a clean shutdown, not a uh, hard shutdown, because otherwise it will corrupt the disk. Um, here's another feature that I set up last night. Um, I always misplace my phone. So here's the solution. Alexa, turn on Quee's iPhone. Okay. Alexa, turn on red iPad. Okay. So sometimes my daughter gets carried away watching her iPad when it's dinner time or whatever. So I got this other new feature. Alexa, turn off red iPad mini. Okay. So it locks it, puts it in uh, lost mode, um, kicks you out of your app, shuts off our shows uh, for the lazy parent. So next is a series demonstration. Hey Siri, turn on arcade machine. Okay, the arcade machine is turned off. Oh, she misheard me. Hey Siri, turn on arcade machine. Okay, the arcade machine is turned on. So, turning on the arcade machine is through Wake on LAN. Alexa can do the same. I just want to demo demonstrate series. Uh, Siri doesn't work as well as Alexa, I think, uh, just because I think Siri can do more and it doesn't understand everything I say. Um, Siri, hey Siri, turn on dining room light. Okay, the dining room light is turned on. So, there you have it. terms of hardware, so let's uh, go through the hardware setup here. Um, Alexa, turn off TV LED. A little distracting here. Okay. So the Amazon Echo, obviously, is the main piece. Um, I bought it a while back, so I had it, uh, I pre-ordered it, so I got the voice remote. That allows me to um, command it from my desk. Um, again, the Echo is usually in the kitchen. Um, so I don't have to yell uh, from my desk to to activate it. Um, this is a TP-Link uh, Archer C7. Um, it's my access point up here. Uh, a Logitech Harmony Hub. This is the universal remote. It controls the TV, controls my soundbar, controls the uh, RGB LED behind my TV. Um, pretty neat device. It's actually uh, powered through USB off the TP-Link on the USB ports behind the TV-Link router. 
um, this is a Raspberry Pi 2 and a um, Z-Wave stick. I will also be adding a camera and stuff to it. I'll be mounting it behind the TV. Um, I have a Wink Hub. It isn't doing much for me right now. Um, it's it's only got a few lights connected to it um, through this bulb. It was on sale. I bought a few bulbs to go with it. Um, the living room lights actually a Wink bulb. I will be rooting, trying to root the hub again. Um, I already have my serial cable right there for it, um, so that I can integrate it with OpenHab. Um, so the RGB LEDs are just really cheap LEDs um, controlled by this uh, infrared thing right here. I will be hiding that behind the TV so it won't be hanging out like that. Um, the arcade machine again is a Windows PC uh, running Hyperspin. It's a pretty cool little toy here. Alexa, turn off Arcade Machine. Okay. Uh, Software-wise, I'm running all open source software. Uh, OpenHab is running on the Pi. I'm using an Echo Bridge that's also running on the Pi. Um, HomeKit Bridge for series uh, that's running on the Pi too. For the iCloud, Find My iPhone and Lost Mode features, I'm using a PHP script to uh, talk to iCloud to find my phone. Thought that was a pretty neat thing. Um, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, here's the remote for the uh, RGB LED. Again, you pick it up for like 20 bucks on Amazon. Uh, the Logitech Harmony Hub actually has a profile for this particular remote. Um, so you don't, you don't have to get one of the Hue LED strips that are really expensive um, to go with that. So I hope you guys like the video, like it, share it. Um, I will try to put together a tutorial on um, how to set this all up. It's a little complicated, but uh, definitely rewarding if you uh, want to do it. Have a good day. Bye.